measures have been extended until at least November 23rd. But from then on, restrictions on open-air activities as well as outdoor bar and restaurant terraces could be eased if pandemic-related figures continue to progress favorably. Hello, this is Catalan News in 100 seconds. Bars, sports centers, and cultural venues will remain closed for another 10 days. All measures, as well as the partial weekend lockdown and the closure of land borders, have been extended, but now beauty and massage parlors are allowed to reopen. Authorities could begin to ease restrictions on open-air activities and restaurant terraces on November 23rd. Però sempre hem de mirar aquest element principal de salut, perquè és la nostra responsabilitat, necessitem aquests 10 dies. Els necessitem. People wanting to enter Spain by air or sea from all EU and EEA countries except for Finland and parts of Greece, Portugal and Denmark will be required to provide a negative PCR test upon arrival from November 23rd. Published today, the list also includes 37 other countries, including the UK or the US. Josep Lluís Trapero has been reinstated as the head of Catalonia's Mossos de Squadra police force. Trapero, who was the police chief during the 2017 independence referendum, was recently acquitted by Spain's national court for his role during the vote. Carles Puigdemont will run in the upcoming election for his party, Junts per Catalunya, but not as its presidential candidate. He acknowledges the possibility of being reinstated to the post from exile. Ja m'ho esperava perquè d'alguna manera eh, ja vam veure l'any 2017 que va dir que es presentaria i que si guanyava vindria a ser president, això no va ser així. Catalan Migrant Rescue NGO Open Arms has saved 250 people over the past few days in the Mediterranean. But they weren't able to save all of the refugees they encountered, including a six-month-old baby.